Coach Malky, you're here in Omaha. You brought a national championship to LSU as well in your second year. What's it like to watch Jay Johnson bring a, cha a national championship to Baton Rouge? I'm just so happy for Jay. I'm happy for the players. I'm happy for LSU, and I'm happy for the state of Louisiana. Absolutely. And look, your son Kramer played baseball for LSU as well. What's it like just to watch this team? Uh, knowing all the talented players that have come through here, Kramer, one of them, finally be being able to bring a seventh national championship to this program. It's emotional because the last LSU team here was Kramer's last year and they so close and they were playing those Florida Gators. And so Kramer's actually in Baton Rouge. He didn't want to come. He's crying. He's so happy. It's a fraternity. Once you're a part of the team, and program you are for life and so it's kind of like his heart is a little bit relieved and comforted now I'm just grateful I'm just happy for everybody yeah that team in 2017 went 0-2 in the championship series brutal night for LSU last night what was it like for them to put up 18 win 18-4 to tonight I said you know we put up 121 points in our championship mm. And we put up 18 tonight, and I say we, that's because we're LSU, baby. That's what you call a good day. Thank you so much, Coach. Enjoy the, the championship. You betcha. Yes, ma'am. All right, well, Kim Mulkey bringing a national championship in her second season with LSU women's basketball. Jay Johnson follows it up in his second year with LSU baseball as well, winning a national championship with the Tigers, seventh in program history, first since 2009. And uh, what a night, like I mentioned with head coach Kim Mulkey. This was a huge win for LSU. And uh, just like LSU women's basketball, it seemed like tonight and throughout this entire postseason run for the Tigers, they had players step up and deliver their best outings when the team needed it the most. So what an incredible night for LSU baseball. And we're going to continue to kind of try to find some players to talk to as well. <laughs>